Uh, so I guess matchup to look for here, probably obviously most notable name on the board here, probably Duke Mean. Uh, probably facing up against more gooder, more than likely. We're going to see what kind of matchup we got there. I have no game audio. My game audio is very low. Let me, uh, Is very quiet for some reason. I'm already crashed. Okay, so we probably have to redo the lobby real quick. We'll see what happens. Oh, no, it looks like they're just playing through. Okay, Cam is actually fine. So, yeah, 2K got to be in the first sack of the game on that play. Blair just trying to get out to his right. No room really in front of him as the line doesn't hold up that well. While now, Blurry, second and 13. Has a comeback over the middle here. His time hitting BBQ Pringle. He'll think of exactly the 13 they need to get that first down. And keep the drive rolling. All right, so now inside. Just barely inside fear territory. A little line completely collapses there. Bows not even getting a shield on him. Other side of the field, he got Bubblegum not even getting a shield either. Or killing one remotely close to getting Alexander there, and that's going to be another sag with some a bigger one of 16 yards. Okay, so now we're going to see a roll left, trying to get to the hash. Actually, avoid cheesecake that time. Blurry running out of space. Don't you see the ball out? He'll just toss it up. Bloopy might have a chance to pick. That can be actually a little bit overthrown there. Actually enough for him. We're going to love to see another play here. Now, Blurry on a third and 26. See if he's got it in him. Trying to convert this Blurry. Forcing the four-man rush. Pushback so far. Had a miscommunication with they were doing. It's going to be more good or going to pick it off. So, yeah. Wanted to do Going for the comeback there. Didn't communicate it. He wanted to throw the streak. And uh, Gooder obviously is going to stay behind him there. Going to get the pick deep. And now it's going to be Fear with the ball. So time to see Atachi make his QB debut here in the GFA. He's going to start off with a pretty good run there. I managed to get up the right gap. Takes it for 11 yards. And the first. So Atachi looking to show up here. And make a statement. Maybe a QB for next season. A roll left again here. Baus nearly gets in. Instead, it's thrown up. Seb getting a little bit tangled there with Connor at the end. Unable to find that pass. Going to be incomplete. Too deep there. Now we got a second and 10. Chachi will take another run there so far, but it's only positive plays. Of course, very limited sample size so far. Third and three now here. Let's see how he handles it. Three-man rush. Rolls back to his right. I was going to do a nice job just pushing out, getting the space there from Bubblegun. Blue be going to win the 50 over Pringle and take it into the end zone. Going to be a touchdown. Fear scoring first. They are going to go for the two-point conversion, really trying to uh, show it off here. It's not about who wins the tournament, after all. It's about how mainly just showing out yourself ready for the next season, who will be the QEs for the draft. Uh, going to find the two-point conversion. Nice in route there. From good or just playing that safety corner. Got an 8-0 lead. Time to see how Blurry responds, though. Blurry doing a nice job. Actually makes some great moves. Gets in just beyond the 40 there to the 41 where he'll begin this drive. All right, so Blurry going to be rolling to his left. And that line just not holding up ahead of him. 
going to be a 14 yard sack this time to Cam Newton's last up already. Three sacks on the game, four fear in total. As they're making the presence felt on that D line. And the O line held up really well, too. As Alexander just gets right by there, Flurry going to barely get that one out. A comeback there to BBQ Pringle. He'll get about eight yards on that one. Make now third and 16. Coming up for Misfits. Blurry, once again, going to center himself on the field this time. Good job by the line there, but he just throws it way too short. Two people underneath Doomy, and he's got to toss it up higher. I don't know why he was trying to, if he was trying to, like, dot it in or something. But just a really ill-advised throw there by Blurry, and now Fear with another chance to score. Prime position, just a little bit shy of the 50, Itachi. Nice job rolling back to his right there. Keep himself poised. Looking to take a run and has it. 11 yards there. Going to get him inside Misfits territory as they're marching already. Ooh. Wow, making a great inside move there. Cheesecake not normally playing that uh tackle spot. Maybe a little bit of miscommunication. Oh, actually, no. It was some weird miscommunication because uh, Cheesecake was outside there where Cam was. Although a screen this time, Cam getting out there trying to block will be a 10-yard pickup for Seb getting some of those yards back. Yeah, a little miscommunication there on the line on the first down, it seems, between Cam and Cheesecake as Bows kind of sells inside for free. Meanwhile, now a third and eight here for Tachi and Fear. will be rolling to... Left, more gooder, tossing it down field to more gooder. Going to be a 38 yard pickup. Beautiful dot. Dropped it in there perfectly. Gooder, or nobody going to catch that one. As now they got a first and goal. Two yards to go for Tachi to put another one in for fear. And right up the gut, going to be just that. Going to celebrate here with the demon wings coming out as fear takes a 14 0 lead pending the extra points. And they're going to kick it instead of going for the two-point. Interesting. No, I like it. Show all aspects of the game. You got to be able to kick field goals, too, if you are a quarterback. One of the... A, a very underrated aspect of the game is that special team, so... Good job. We got 15-0 here for Misfits. All right, Blurry with his third chance on offense here. Hasn't been able to do anything. Two picks so far for him. Two more gooder nonetheless on that dupe me matchup as he's trying to get the run established on this drive. We'll only get about three yards there. But still, positive yards are positive yards. So, second and seven now here. Misfits looking to get their first score on the board, trying to make it not a complete blowout. Eventually, you're going to get another three yards there. Grinding it out on a pass to BBQ Pringle there. So far, Doomian really underutilized, I'd say. I mean, he's tried throwing to him, but there's been miscommunication between uh, Blurry and Dupe. Although Blurry going to take a six-yard run there. Gets the first to their own 45-yard line. Yeah, it's not, it's not even like they're really doubling, dude, it feels like. It's just uh, in the miscommunication. Is he might have been open on that post if he lets it develop a little bit more. It's not going to throw the comeback pressure in his face there. We'll hit Connor for seven yards. Ooh, a little bit late on the rush. I don't know what Cam was doing there. A completely blocked out as Blair going to go for a free run there on the left. 16-yard gain.
All right, we're hitting the last about 20 seconds as Seb just blitzes. Getting fancy with it. Bouse was going on the leak, I believe. But Seb just blitzing right at the middle, completely unblocked by Spork or Bubblegum. It'll lead to an 11-yard sack, pushes him back towards midfield. Though Blurry has a huge gap open. They're going to pick up 8 yards, get a bit of it back. As we're probably hitting about the last play of the quarter. So far, Fear on top by 15, but Misfits driving. Be only a three-man rush there. Good blocking by the line this time. Gives him some time. Throws a comeback, but going to be a minimal gain there. Do mean only going to pick up one a yard as Gooder makes the immediate tackle at the second quarter with a fourth and 12 for Blurry and the Misfits here. All right, Blurry. Going to be facing four-man rush. Fourth down. Has Dooming there. First down. Going to catch it right on spot. Gooder giving up too much leverage for the comeback. And Dooming actually manages to avoid him for the tackle and get enough yardage for that touchdown. So going to be a score here for Misfits as Dooming finally making his presence felt there. Gooder just a little bit undisciplined there. Could have just played for the contain. Instead, was too aggressive trying to make the tackle and ends up getting punished for it. As now, it's going to be just eight points separating these teams. This fits currently on the board with seven. All right, Itachi, gonna be keeping this on the ground. Been pretty good so far with taking his runs. Uh, only been really stopped that one time by Baus, which wasn't even a run attempt. It was more of a pass attempt that Baus just did a good inside sell for. But Itachi, grounded and pounding it so far. 32 yards positive for him as he's gonna add another 10 there. As they are just gonna stop the run here. They have pretty much four linemen as Blurry up. A uh, former alignment, I guess. Will be lined up in that gap. They just send Cam Newton on the leak. Seb this stays there for the screen. They find him quickly, and he's going to be able to slide up. Pick up 12 yards and another first. So Tachi showing the no-wall to... Uh, if you're going to show four in the line, we will send that line leak. We will punish you for that. Not a lot of QBs really take advantage of it. As Cam's going to go again, blurry... So far off his man, but he's going to look for Gooder here deep, and it's going to be a little bit overthrown, just a little bit too much on it, as Gooder is going to let it bounce pretty much away from his fingertips. Add Cam wide open on the left here as well, but didn't probably want to throw a cross body, especially to a lineman perhaps. A little bit of concern there, but still would have been a good option. Wide open though, as Seb's going to be streaking down the field right behind BBQ. Pringle is going to spot pot that one, get another 37 yards. And a first as they're inside the 20 now. Tachi looking to strike again and take the two possession lead back. See what you have to do. He's going to roll to the right. He sends Cam on that leak again. Playing that really annoying leaking offense. Trying to punish this Misfits team for their lack of maybe depth in the secondary. As they're still showing this four-man rush. Tachi... Will run into it. Doesn't care. Makes a great cut there. Dooming can't make the tackle. Atachi going to score his second rushing touchdown of the game. Take that two-possession lead back. And they are looking perfect so far on the day. They will go for the kick again. And kick is up. Kick is good. So 22-7 is the current score. With 2.49 left in the half. All right, then. I can see Blurry and the Misfits taking another kickoff here. Connor does a great job just staying patient there. The special team so far, you know, if there's one positive thing to say about this squad, it is the uh, it is that their special teams, you know, their kickoff teams have looked uh, pretty good so far, I'd say. So we're going to see what Blurry does with this 
pretty decent starting field position. As we'll be rolling to the left here. <gasps> and kind of gets sold by his wide receiver core there. I believe Q Pringle just kind of jumping past the ball. Excuse me, maybe could have made a play on it too. As it did sail near his area. But probably wasn't expected to be caught there. Was probably looking for the block. Initially going to be a three yard run here on second and ten though. Trying to make it a bit more manageable for this third down attempt. Flurry, rolling. We'll cut back to his left here. Good job with the pocket movement. This time throwing it up. Connor deep. Gonna have that. And he's gonna take it in for a touchdown. Just behind everybody there. Gonna be a 48-yard catch and a run for the touchdown. Blurry initially doing a good job getting pressure there on the right. Cuts back to his left and throws it downfield as secondary getting a bit lazy there. Didn't think he'd throw opposite side of the field. Perhaps just letting Connor get past them. Lots of space there. He makes the catch. Makes them get punished for their decisions there. But two-point conversion going to be incomplete. And now they're going to be down by still uh, two scores. It's only going to be 13 to 22. Nine points. Going to take two possessions to make up. Uh, you almost wonder maybe... If you don't want to go for the two point there, maybe go for the one point and keep it a uh, one score game. But you know what? It's better to maybe know your uh, situation earlier than it is to try and make it up later. As Itachi, I mean, this guy's playing perfectly. He's running, making the moves when he needs to, he's throwing really well. He's taking advantage of the different rushes he's seeing. He's seeing the two-man front with the three blitzers from Blurry and Spork. As he's going to abuse the run again there. And now we're seeing safety pressure again. So Spork and Blurry just lined up directly in the gap. And he's dropping back the pass. He does send Alexander this time on the league. So yeah, I mean... So far, he's just calling perfect plays to take advantage of these... Different things secondary is showing him. More good are actually going to lose a yard on that catch. From the previous play, bad blocking there as Alexander will be sent down on the streak there. And good are just going to moss Duke mean for 34 yards. Itachi in duress just throws it up to his 50 bottom and finds a first down. Nearly a first and goal here as Itachi going to run it up again. Only find about a yard. Or Dootmean makes the play. As they're staying in the safety pressure. So both the DTs going to be lined up in that gap. Achi will fake roll, left roll, right here. Has plenty of room. And we'll just throw this one away. Back of the end zone. Right, third and nine now. At the 10 yard line, Itachi throws it. Quick. It's going to be a comeback in the middle there for Bloop. He catches it right at the first down. And also now set up a first and goal from the one yard line. Probably going to look to run it in. He does his third rushing touchdown of the day. Going to bring the Demon Wings back out again. As so far, fear is. Perfect on the day on offense. We'll see what they do. Two point conversion. Liatachi rolling to his right. Sends Cam out on the leak and he'll run it in himself. Get the two point, make it a 30 to 13 game as 17 points now separate these teams. As Misfits are really on the back foot here. All right, so Blurry, sail trailing now by three scores. See what he's got in him. He's going to run up the middle, hugs his lineman really well there. 
or not get tackled. We'll call a timeout there as the one minute expires. So trying to get any sort of points here. Even a field goal would be nice for him just to get him in that, uh, pretty much get his score back to just two possessions. As Doomin doing a nice job, hits the comeback there. That is Lurie. And he's able to just slide around his guy, pick up an extra eight yards, 20 yards in total. As they're now inside fear territory. Misfits driving, looking for some points here. It's going to be interesting to note as well. Fear does get the ball at half. As Blurry, be hopping back to the left there, but eventually Alexander's going to catch up with him. Just nobody uh, he's trusting to throw the ball to right now. Blurry going to take a 12-yard sack. All right now, second and 22, just around the corner there. Going to be Cheesecake getting a 16-yard sack, leading to now a third and 38. Flurry needs to find some positive yards here. See what happens. Flurry rolling to his left. BBQ Gringo over the middle. Going to make it a manageable fourth down. Actually gets a lot of yak there. 21 yards in total as the last timeout is called. Fourth and 17 now here. Flurry taking his time, letting the uh, board calls to play. Four-man rush coming out, and it doesn't matter. The line doesn't block well enough. It's going to be a 17-yard sack. Turn over on downs, and worst-case scenario, Fear is already at the 30-yard line. Because they can just kick a field goal whenever they want, but they're going to go for a touchdown more than likely. going to be Itachi rolling to the left here. As Bows can't reach him, misses the sack opportunity. Itachi should probably go out of bounds. Instead, he'll have to waste a timeout there. Uh, I mean, with all three timeouts, you're probably fine with either or. Nice play there, Itachi, though. Able to get the first down and more inside the 20 now. It'll be Itachi rolling to the right. In the red, he just throws it back of the end zone. Going to fall incomplete. We got a 40-ish second halftime here. We're going to look at the stats a little bit blurry. I mean, he's completed the passes, you know, that haven't been picked. Uh, he's completed 10 of 13 passes, 161. Look, looks, you know, he's looking good when he's not pressured, but that's the issue. He's been pressured a lot by this fear line. Uh, you can see that in the negative 43 rush yards. Meanwhile, Tachi, the other side of the field, he's 9 of 13. So slightly less accurate, ironically enough. Uh, hasn't been picked off, though. And it really hasn't been pressured by this line. Only one sack coming out of that Misfits line so far as to the seven coming out of the fear line. Uh, 197 through the air, 81 yards on the ground. I mean, they're just killing them through every means necessary on offense here. So we'll see how we adjust here for the second half. As it will be fear. Seb making some good moves there. As I think they're looking for a pause real quick. No gooder. Pausing real quick. Oh, we can take a look at some of the other scores. Around so far, Meteors are down 0 to 15 to Apollo. Their scores currently are 7 to 13, Anomaly leading UFO. And let's begin in the conspiracy stream. It is 6 to 14, Minions leaving over Goon Squad. So uh, let me let me see what the pause is about, real quick. Uh, blurry. Why pause?
I just hope this doesn't end up crashing the game when, uh... Okay, well, I guess we're taking the gamble here by pausing the game. Uh, Seb apparently had something IRL, so hopefully he clears that up pretty quickly. Hopefully it's nothing too bad. I don't know what the... Uh... I just hope it doesn't end up crashing the lobby when he does unpause, because sometimes that can happen, especially depending on the longer you have it paused. I think it, you know what it probably is? Nah, it's probably nothing like that. I was going to say, probably like, kick stem for being AFK or something. I don't 100% know. Who knows? Yeah, I guess they'll tune in to see what some of the other games are. Still 6-14. Looks like they just hit halftime on the Meteors versus Apollo game. So, uh, 0 Meteors, 15 Apollo. And then, once again, the last game here is UFO 7 Anomaly is currently 13. So those are your scores so far. Okay, we are taking the risk. Looks like they want on pause. We'll just play the 6v7 for a few moments while they're waiting for Seb to get back. Uh, it's good to know whoever wins the Meteor vs. Apollo game will end up facing the winner of this game. So that's who I'll probably be going on to next. As it looks like we unpaused, nobody has crashed. That is great news. As it will be a toss back on offense here. First drive of the half. Going to be Spork getting a five yards back. Looks like Connor. Yeah, Connor just going to wait it out, I guess. Till Bloopy's back. Still showing some good sportsmanship there from the uh, Misfit side. Not trying to take abuse of the fact that they have the extra man. It's going to be Seb downfield, though. Wait, wasn't Seb the reason they paused? Is he back? I'm so confused. Oh no, it was Bloopy was the reason they paused. Uh, it's going to be a run there. 11 yards. Getting back on track here so far, Tachi. Playing a fairly clean, perfect game so far. Looking to keep this rolling here. As they currently lead by 17. As Bows makes a great play there just makes the inside move cuts back outside behind his lineman with a dive and hits Itachi perfectly to make him lose 12 yards on the play now it's going to be second and 22 four man rush coming in as that's going to be another sack now a third and 37 Ooh, pressure all on Itachi's face. He throws it up. 50, but you can't 50. Do me like that. I mean, major leader throwing pressure in his face is going to result in a pick here for Misfits as well, the 6v7 could be their chance to come back, even though, you know, they're, they're playing it pretty honestly. Uh, 
Uh, we'll see if they decide just to keep it two wide receivers or what they opt to do. Looks like they're sending out all receivers. As actually, Bloopy is back. So yeah, looks like they're live on all aspects here. Uh, gonna find a nice in route there to dupe me. Takes about 15, gets them around their own 42 yard line. Looking to try and make this game a bit closer now. 13 to 30 as Bloopy, or sorry, as a uh, Blurry getting pressured there, but managed to step up and avoid it. We'll take a seven yard run there from the sold contain on the left, where he's eventually tackled there. Tachi now lining up in that safety gap, along with Alexander right in the line. So we'll see if they try to send some leaks of their own. That's how Tachi's countered this. Oh man, blurry though. Trying to bob and weave around the pocket. Can only do it so much as Alexander eventually going to find himself with a 13-yard sack. Now a third and 16 here for blurry as he's having probably one of the worst experiences of his life in that pocket right now. It's just collapsing all around him. Cheesecake rounds the corner against Bubblegum. And it's going to be now a fourth and 30. Find a dupe mean needs to be the name of the game. As you're seeing Seb and Gooder and Bloopy all just back up. Itachi blitzing from the outside, trying to stop him from stepping up. In the same direction as Doom, he's throwing it up. Connor has a shot at this, and Connor's going to spot out that one. 35 yards and a first for the Misfits as they keep this drive alive. Blurry throwing his poise there, not panicking. He's trying to step up into the lineman pressure. Just stops, sets his feet, and throws it downfield to where he believes his, his receiver can get it. And Connor makes the play, rewarding him with a first. A huge check there for... Blurry as Cam. Oh my. Just makes a great inside move there. Another big sack as they're just chaining them together. It doesn't seem like this Misfits line is really on a... On like a good page together. You know, oh man, Cheesecake. Nearly going to pick up another one. As I said, Blurry manages to barely dash away from it. We'll find Doot Mean for a comeback of 11 yards. Hits now a third and 15 here. As Blurry does need to be a little wary of the clock. Uh, not that there's still not time left, but uh, it's been definitely winding down quickly here. As he's going for it, Doot Mean! Looking for the pylon, the kind of corner throw there. But Doot Mean got to be double covered. Gooder doing an amazing job just body blocking there. As high, low, doesn't matter. Doom Mean had a defender on both ends of him, and now it's going to be Fear. Back with ball in hand. Although, might be a safety situation. Might be a safety situation. I could make it a two-possession game so they get it. Four man on the line. Might send a leak here. If he's fast enough about it. No, he doesn't. He's just throwing a moon ball. A moon ball in this economy. Well, he's going to find Seb for 27 yards. Picks up that first. Gets him out of their own end zone. And now Patachi can go back to playing his game. And by playing his game, I mean he gets sacked by Blurry for four yards, who just instantly slides in the gap. Still. With a three-possession lead, Itachi doesn't need to panic here. Really, all he needs to do is just uh, manage clock, I'd say. Nothing too extreme. Just really don't want to give uh, too much time back to either team. Try and give them a chance. Try and give them hope. They come back. Just try to manage the game and really just close it out here as... We're winding down into the last minute of the third quarter. Gooder outside. Gotta catch that one. Doomin diving misses. And Gooder might have a free lane to the end zone. No, Doomin eventually gonna catch him from behind, but not before he picks up 62 yards in total. And sets now first and goal inside the five. Gooder on Dude's head. Otachi so trying to find that right lane that he's found for three touchdowns already. 
won't find it that time. Bubblegum gonna make the play in the gap there. Hachi this time looking to pass it. Rolls back and tosses it out of the back of the end zone. No one gonna be able to catch that one. As now a quick third and goal here for Beer. The Itachi throwing a beautiful in route there. Beautiful kind of slant in from Seb. No hesitation, right on point for his player. And now it's 36 to 13. Beer on top of Miss. All right, Blurry, going to have the ball back here. Down by, I mean, so, so many points. Uh, 23 in total. I mean, you got to make some plays somewhere. You, you see a lot of deep coverage there. You see, you see Pringle available. Kind of in the mid intermediate areas. Everybody kind of S-keyed, trying to prevent the big plays. With the fourth quarter now, four minutes. Separate us from the end of the game. Will Misfits somehow bring out a miraculous comeback, really? Or will it be Fear just keeping their dominance going? As Camden's laptop gonna find himself a sack there. Blurry just not pulling the trigger on the throw soon enough again. Finds himself deep 11 yards in his backfield. Blurry just throwing a blob 50. Connor coming down with that one. 37 yards. Connor been the top performer for uh, Misfits so far. Four catches, 133. Ty's Gooder on the other team who's leading his team. Four catches, 133, ironically enough. So Connor landed on the line trying to win this, but uh. Oh man, Blurry. Gonna get inside sold again by Bubblegum. Just can't get a shield on Camden's laptop. When the man transitioned the line, nobody thought he'd be this good. Five sacks already. Cam's laying it on him. As he might almost has another one there. It's at another blob. 50 for the end zone and dupe mean. Gonna show himself there. 35-yard touchdown. Makes this game a little bit closer. Blurry trying to do the trust there. Instead, he trusts Bloopy, who was on the other team. Going to catch that one, get incomplete. And we're back to now a 17 point difference between the teams. And we're seeing Tachi finally wind down the clock, too, trying to take this game to its end. It'll be Tachi rolling to his right here. Four-man rush doesn't matter until he tries to go for the run. But a uh, nice job just setting the edge there by this fear line.
Oh man, Bloopy, nice catch and a run there. Great blocking downfield by Seb. Allows Bloopy to get about 53 yards as you're still looking nigh untouchable. Good the clock continues to wind down. One fifty four, one fifty two left here, second and ten here. Or touching the fear boys. Outside of you know that one sixty seven drive looking rates in all aspects. Gonna toss it up here. Gonna be back in the end zone. Nobody gonna be able to reach that one third and ten now as clock does get stopped by the uh ball falling incomplete. Thought you were rolling to his left again. Probably looking for either Seb or Bloopy there and back left. Get another chance to instead. Bell's going to stop him early. For an 11 yard sack now, fourth and 21 for Fear. Could be their first, uh, I'd say, real stop of the game. But probably far too little too late here for the Misfits. As do I mean just gonna win the fifty there. And now uh, Blur gonna be back on offense from his own twenty. Gonna try and get some brownie points here as they're down by three scores. Gonna be pretty hard to make up at the end of the day. Blurry though has some time. Throws it. Another blob though. And I mean do mean at the end of it just gonna catch it. Flurry tries to blob it again. Ain't gonna be incomplete. Step will get the touch back there, and we hit our final minute as a touch. He's probably looking to hand it off. No, he keeps himself a little bit trickery coming out. He's gonna be eventually tackled by Blair, but now before he gets five yards. Timeout coming out from Misfits there. Gonna try and Claw it till the end. But it's probably far too little too late for them. Oh man. Blurry. Or sorry, Tachi tries to force it deep to gooder there, but gives Doomin leverage. And if yeah, if there's one thing I know, if you give Doomin leverage, he's not selling the ball well that often. So, Blur, you're going to have a chance to at least try and score here. Make himself seem a little bit better. As Line holds up well on that play, and then he throws that. I don't know what he threw. I don't know why he threw what he just threw. So, anyways, figure back on offense now as they're playing hot potato. Neither team wants to keep the ball. What a battle. Gooder and Dooming, both with four picks of their own. Or three and four picks, respectively. Only four seconds left. Probably Tachi looking to just grind out these last wee seconds here. He rolls to his left. Throwing it. Might have Seb there. He does. Great play by them. Going to get a last second score. Make it 42. Currently at 19. GG's coming out in chat.
as it will be fear advancing on to face either meteors Uh, to face either the meteors or the Apollo next year. Okay, that's going to be all they wrote on the game. 44-19. to 19. Fear going to win over the Misfits. 